Um, my name is Aretha and welcome to my channel. So today is a very interesting day. Uh, if, um, if I haven't been posting or vlogging very much, I'm sorry. I do try to post as much as I can, but I've been really, really busy these past couple months, past couple weeks and yeah. Ugh, I just literally flew to Ottawa earlier this week and I live in Alberta and that's Ontario. It's like four hours away by plane <laughs> and um, yeah I'm pretty tired and exhausted uh, so if you don't know um, not only was I next one next one is next uh, if you don't know if you didn't follow me on like a lot of the things where I talk about like what I kind of do you'll know that I've actually been a filmmaker and um, I created a documentary on the Truth and Reconciliation um, Commission, which is about residential schools in Canada and things like that. And um, so anyways, uh, we have a screening on October 23rd where we're gonna have a panel discussion afterwards and we're gonna have like uh, one of the commissioners, Chief Bolton Littlechild, is gonna be part of the panel and the youth that helped us create the film. Okay. <laughs> and, um, and so, yeah i've been trying to plan that and promote that and then i took a small contract and i was helping promote a film festival because i was working with them and so and i'm still kind of doing that too and i'm also a board member of the aboriginal congress of alberta association which is the alberta chapter of the congress of aboriginal people which they had their aga and again i was in i was in ottawa for that as well and oh my goodness just so many things are happening at the same time and i also applied for this story hive grant where basically i created this project and I got a whole bunch of people to vote for it and um, the top 30 ones got selected. So it's a good thing I'm recording this now because I can tell you that today is Thursday. I just got an email saying that I was selected and they will be announcing the winners tomorrow on Friday. So by the time this video goes up, that will have already been announced. So I'm so excited, yay! So now I gotta get that up and going because you have to commit to creating a pilot web series episode by January. So I have to get on that, yeah. Um, because of my nonprofit work and everything, I have so many things on the go. I'm actually um, on my way into the Dream Speaker's office because I do have some things that I'm still finishing up and working on. But I also have a board meeting tonight because I'm also a part of another board called uh, uh, First Alberta Campus Radio Association, so it's Campus Radio, and so I have a board meeting tonight. And then after that meeting, I'm going to go meet up with my business partner, who's part of the who co-owns the production company with me, and we're going to go talk about what we need to get done because there's certain things I need to get done before October 13th for me to get the money to start this project. Oh my God, it's so much to do. If you look at my eyes. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Oh my goodness. I am so tired. I'm so beyond tired. Yeah, I've been writing grants like crazy. I actually, because of the AGA, I actually missed one of the grants because I totally forgot about the time difference. So I thought I had till 12 noon, but it ended up being 10 my time because it was actually 12 noon Eastern time. And so that means it was due at 10 and I knew I had one question or whatever and I couldn't figure out which one it was because I was trying to scroll down and finally when I found it fixed up I was too over the word limit so then I tried fixing it and then by the time I submitted it, it was already 10 and I was already like yeah I was so mad because I spent so much time on this grant and also there was an age limit and you had to be un like 34 and under to apply for this grant and I'm 34 this year so meaning that when they do this next year I won't I won't qualify so this would have been the last year I could have got that grant and so oh, I was so mad about that one but it's hard because I'm trying to do all these grants at the same time plus oh and plus argue with EI at the same time EI's I'm finally getting EI and so I have to apply for jobs at the same time um, I'm still applying for work and full-time work um, because that's one of the requirements of EI plus you know it's good to have a job and not live off EI. <laughs> um, and EI is not for that. It's between jobs kind of thing. But yeah, unless I get my production company up and running and then I don't need an EI. So it's like, uh, it's kind of like so many things, so many things. So I'm applying, oh goodness, pardon me. So I'm applying for so many grants to get this stuff done. And yeah, I'm literally going crazy. But yeah. 
So that's my little update. I'm going to try to post more. Oh, and I just joined this little group. It's called Fitmas. So basically it's 12 weeks to Christmas. I think it starts on Monday that I'm going to post and I'm going to be posting my weight. So basically I'm going to get on this fitness um, group with a bunch of other people. Pardon me. Um, so I'm going to get on this fitness group with a bunch of other people and we're going to start uh, vlogging every Monday about um, our fitness and things like that leading up to uh, Christmas. So basically it's called, yeah, it's called fitness. So I decided to join that and I will be posting that soon. Um, I think it starts this Monday. I think so. I don't think it was supposed to start last Monday. I don't think anyway. I, I hope not because if not, I'm going to be a week late. <laughs> Uh, I, yeah, I have so many things to do. I literally have been surviving off like five, like less, five hours has been good for me. Like if I can get five hours, I'm awesome. But yeah, I guess this week I've been getting like less than five hours of sleep at night and I'm really not handling that well. <laughs> um, I'm the type of person that needs like eight to nine hours of sleep to feel rested. So I normally adjust my time schedule so that I can get that amount of sleep and I haven't been doing very good on it. And so, yeah, I'm really, really tired. I'm probably just rambling now, but yeah. So I'm also doing that. So you will be seeing more of me. I will be posting more. I do promise. I, you know, I was actually going to start this thing in October where I was actually going to vlog every single day, no matter what it was and like do it on my phone, quickly upload it, no editing, no nothing, no cutting anything out, you know, cause that just takes more time and posting just what's on here and just posting it on there. And then because October is uh, the 10th month, I was going to make it just, you know, no more than 10 minutes long. So yeah. Oh my goodness. There's so many things to tell you about, but guess what? I still have the rest of the month to tell you about all the busy things that I have to do in October. <sighs> yeah. Did I mention I was tired? Anyways, if you want to follow me and the projects that I'm about to work on and everything like that, please feel free to subscribe. Don't forget to like this video if you liked it. And, um, if you need to, click on the little bell icon that will tell you every single time I upload so that you get the notifications and yeah I don't know let me know what um what, what do you have planned for October do you have anything really planned for October I don't know about you but I feel like a lot of people are in the same boat as me and are really busy in October so let me know are you busy this October because I'm busy this October <laughs>